Hey guys, welcome back. Today in this video, I'm going to share with you how to add sound effects in KineMaster and to edit them too. We're going to start off with something simple, how to add sound effects to your videos in KineMaster. I'm going to show you how to gradually increase the volume and other effects. And as always, let me jump to the shoutouts. The movie trivia shout-out goes to Nolan Talks Movies. You got it twice in a row, so good job on that. And yes, your quote is from Moana. The Everyday Fan shout out goes to a Go Gaming YT. You're supportive, I appreciate it, and shout out to you. Okay, so we have Kind Master opened. We're just gonna open a new project. Of course, 16 to 9 as always. And I'm gonna get some random clip. So, of course, I click media, then all. Let's just take me rolling on a skateboard clip. Then click check mark. And then, of course, in Kind Master, you have sound effects on the right side where it says audio. So, you have music, sound effects, and etc. Let's just put some music. Also, you can go to the store and download some extra music. If you want to test any song, scroll through and then there's going to be a play button. And then just click it. And on the left side, you have genres like acoustic, electric, and etc. So for example, we like this song, then click download. And normally once you click the audio, all the songs are here. So we basically click the song that we like. Then we click the plus sign. All right, now we have the song, and if you want it to be the beginning of the clip, then move it to the beginning of the timeline. Sometimes it's better to mute the original audio for like the main clip. So for example, if you want to use it as a B-roll or something cinematic, so click the main clip, click mixer on the right side, then you can pretty much lower the volume. We're gonna put it at zero, and then just click check mark. What's cool about the audio and music, you can actually gradually increase it during the video or decrease it. So for example, at this point, we're gonna click volume envelope on the right side, then click add keyframe, the circle with the plus. As you can see in the bottom, there's a keyframe that's added. So let's say I want to gradually increase it. I go to the beginning of the clip. As you can see, when you point to the keyframe and lower the volume, it's gonna change. So now it goes up gradually. You can do the same thing if you wanna make the music completely quiet gradually. Then I go to the next keyframe and then adjust the volume. You see just like this is moving on the bottom. So now when you play the clip, you see it's going gradually up. I'm sliding the timeline by my hand, but you can see the volume is going up. And same thing if you want some sound effects. So instead of music, you click sound effects. Then you can go to the store and get other effects. Also, some items in the store is only for premium users, but you can watch an ad and download most of the assets. So that's the recent update of Pine Master. Test it before first, obviously. So we're gonna add thunder. This could be good for the intro to thunder. Let me show you a different way to get sound from another clip, for example. I just want to sound from a clip, but I don't want the video. So I'm gonna click layer, then media, and then all. So for example, before I had this intro on Kai Master, that's what I want, but I only want the sound. So you click the clip, scroll down over here in the tools, then click alpha opacity, and then reduce the opacity to zero. And there you go. So you, now there's nothing on the screen, but the sound of the clip stayed. Additionally, you can never even record voiceover. Let me choose some different clip. So we have this clip of Apple Store. Then we're gonna mute the audio completely because we're gonna do a B-roll. So now we have a clip, but no sound. All you do right now is click this microphone where it says Rec. Then you just start the recording and I'm just gonna say, Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna talk about my visit at the Apple Store. Welcome back. Today I'm gonna talk about my visit at the Apple, Apple Store. You see, this is how you record the voiceover. This could be good for gaming and other clips. Additionally, for more detailed editing, always zoom in in the timeline. So now you see the clip doesn't move, but the timeline moves a lot. Additionally, you can use YouTube audio library. The only thing is you have to import the audio clip to your phone. It's mainly on computer, so this is a little bit complicated. Now I have good movie lines for you today. All I'm gonna say, this is from a comedy movie. Excuse me? Hey man, this here, this is my car. Hey now, I ain't done nothing wrong. Now the way I see it, you owe me an apology. What did you just call me? You ain't listening, baby. We ain't got nothing to talk about. Unless if it starts with you saying I'm sorry. Guess the movie title first and correctly and you'll get a shout out in the next video. Also, if you want other Kind Master tutorials, make sure to click this playlist. See you in the next video. Bye guys.